The James Webb Space Telescope has just confirmed something that caused shockwaves in the astronomical community. The interstellar object 3I Atlas, already a source of interest to scientists as an enigmatic visitor from outside of our solar system, has been seen with unprecedented detail using Webb's powerful instruments. What astronomers found has redefined what they think it does. In contrast to previous speculation that it was just transiting through our solar system, new trajectory information has indicated something quite more ominous. It is on a collision course with Mars. This discovery redefines what was previously considered a rare cosmic anomaly into a historic event in the annals of planetary science. Webb's unparalleled power to gaze through the chilly dark expanse of space with its keen infrared sight has provided scientists with the clarity they required to follow 3 I Atlas through the void of space. What started as a mere transitory caller from deep space has become an object of profound scientific value. Its path has been gradually decreasing, and the gravitational pull of the sun has sent it on a path that now intersects Mars directly. Previous estimates had error margins that invited doubt, but Webb's new observations leave hardly any room for uncertainty. Every calculation, every model, and every trajectory estimate points toward one sobering reality, impact. To planetary scientists, that reality is both frightening and thrilling. Mars, traditionally known as Earth's twin in exploration and discovery, has been the object of humanity's robotic interest for years. Its surface, splattered with craters of old impacts, is already a testimony to millions of impacts over billions of years. But this time, the spectacle will not be a relic of the past. It will be a live, unrolling cosmic crash observed in real time. Never in human or mechanical history has such a moment been seen directly. The importance of the moment becomes greater when one considers the nature of 3 I Atlas itself. It is not an asteroid belt fragment, nor a rogue comet after millennia. Like the interstellar objects Umiwamiwa and Comet Borisov, 3 I Atlas is a true visitor from another star system, an emissary from the distant regions of our galaxy. Its composition could contain elements and minerals forged in alien stellar nurseries, coated with dust from ancient supernovae, and shaped by cosmic conditions no human probe has ever encountered. The idea that such extraterrestrial material might soon be delivered directly to Mars is staggering. Researchers looking for evidence of ancient or existing life on the Red Planet can now research how matter from interstellar space interacts with a planetary system. Webb's data have even enabled researchers to quantify the probable degree of the impact. The dimensions of 3 I Atlas are such that the energy released when colliding would easily exceed anything Mars has witnessed as a natural occurrence during human history. The strike would excavate a huge, new crater visible from orbit, sending debris miles into the thin atmosphere of the planet. The dust that forms as a consequence will linger in the air for months or years, changing the climate on Mars in ways that orbiters and rovers will be perfectly placed to analyze. In contrast to Earth, where wind, water, and tectonics sooner or later eliminate such scars, Mars conserves them forever. The crater left by 3 I Atlas will not only be a testament to destruction but an everlasting monument to this interstellar collision. Scientists can hardly wait for the opportunities offered by this collision. All space agencies with operational missions orbiting or present on Mars now await the event in breathtaking detail. Picture the panoply of cameras on the rovers recording the blazing fall of an object that has journeyed for millions, maybe billions, of years across interstellar space. Orbiters will chart the blast and return to map the results, from the extent of ejecta spread to the gentle changes in Martian winds blowing dust across the surface. Each picture, each reading, will make us more aware of impact physics, planetary geology, and interstellar material chemistry. But beneath the science is something deeply human, a sense of cosmic perspective. Mars has been the next great frontier for centuries, a place where humans hope to construct colonies and walk on foreign soil. To realize that this same world, so near to our fantasy, is about to be hit by something from outside the solar system puts us in mind of how capricious and brutal the universe really is. The universe is not a peaceful setting to human endeavor, it is a constantly changing, dynamic playing field of motion, collisions, and serendipitous meetings that display both our vulnerability and our strength. For planetary defense specialists, Webb's find is a sobering reminder. While Mars is the destination this time, 
the reality that interstellar objects can be gravitationally deflected onto collision courses with planets is a reminder of just how dynamic and volatile these visitors are. Even the slightest gravitational push from the sun or a passing planetary flyby can significantly shift their courses. If 3 I Atlas had been nudged slightly differently, Earth would have been in its direct path. This alarming reality drives continued debate regarding detection, tracing, and even potential future deflection of dangerous deep space objects. Mars itself, though, becomes a precious natural laboratory. The collision of 3 I Atlas will provide scientists a once-in-a-lifetime chance to observe what occurs when an interstellar body collides with a terrestrial planet. Scientists can now test and validate computer simulations with hard facts, from debris cloud and thermal pulse to seismic waves propagating through the Martian crust. This event will potentially revolutionize our current knowledge of high-speed impacts and planetary defense. The confirmation timing for Webb couldn't be more serendipitous. Ongoing missions circling Mars, including MAVEN, Mars Odyssey, and the European Space Agency's Trace Gas Orbiter, are all capable of collecting a treasure trove of data from the encounter. Surface rovers' perseverance and curiosity, which remain operational on the planet, may even observe the arrival of 3 I Atlas in their upwards-facing cameras. Even if they are not under the impact zone itself, they may measure atmospheric change, seismic quakes, and gradual settling of dust over their instruments. In this manner, each machine already present on or near Mars is enlisted for a concerted, multi-agency observation effort with the goal of making this cosmic crash a treasure trove of information. There is also the spooky question of what 3 I Atlas might be keeping secret in its icy and rocky core. Its chemical makeup may be totally alien compared to anything within our solar system. Though much of it will burn up on impact, some pieces will integrate with Martian ground, forming a blend of native and interstellar material. Subsequent missions might eventually make their way to the crater and retrieve samples, possibly returning fragments of a second star system, proof that will transform planetary science and the search for extraterrestrial life. Aside from the science, the symbolism is deep. We have not yet walked on Mars, but already we are envisioning bases and colonies on the planet. Webb's find is a sobering reminder of how exposed such aspirations are. Mars, like our world, is no exception to the mayhem of the universe. A settlement in such circumstances in the future would be halted by catastrophic effects. Therefore, 3 I Atlas is both a scientific possibility and a warning, a cautionary note from the cosmos concerning the unpredictable dangers that lie ahead of us outside our planet. The international press has latched onto this discovery, but beneath the headlines is a deeper reality. This tale speaks to our changing relationship with the cosmos. The James Webb Space Telescope, a culmination of human innovation, has provided us with eyes that can see farther and clearer than ever before. That vision has not just shown us galaxies billions of light years distant, but revealed as well a spectacular event taking place in our own cosmic backyard. The story of 3 I Atlas and Mars is a stark reminder that observation turns wonder into knowledge, and knowledge tends to leave us stunned by the size and instability of things. Astronomers are currently laboring around the clock to hone the specifics, the angle, velocity, and precise coordinates on Mars of the impact are all being calculated with Webb's latest information. Every tweak makes for tighter predictions and aids in deciding which instruments to focus on the spectacle. Researchers anticipate seeing shockwaves travel out across the Martian crust and subtle changes in the thin atmosphere of the planet, as orbiters will soon record every measurable consequence. This choreography of observation guarantees that when the impact occurs, nothing will be left out. In the meantime, public interest grows. While distant cosmic collisions occur light years away, this one will play out on a planet near enough for hobby astronomers to witness. Many will train their backyard telescopes on Mars, hoping to catch sight of the spectacular flash signaling the impact. Television news will carry every milestone, from the final approach of the object to the aftermath, so that humanity can share an experience of cosmic history. It's not often that a celestial phenomenon brings scientists and the public together in awe, but this does. Finally, the coming crash of 3 I Atlas against Mars is not just object versus planet, it is the universe reminding us of its frenetic dynamism. Mars, already considered a fossil planet stuck in time, is soon to be reshaped by something completely foreign. 
the red planet will visibly alter, and human vision, via the eyes of our robotic pioneers and telescopes, will bear witness. This fact guarantees that the James Webb confirmation will be one of the most defining cosmic discoveries of our time. 